Well, what's up, America? This is old Jim Bob coming to you from a secret location somewhere in America. I thought today I'd do a little commentary on weeds. You know, uh, people are always trying to kill and get rid of weeds, and they don't like them, and uh, I don't think that's right. I like weeds. they got a good purpose in the uh, scheme of things, and uh, people ought to not be trying to get rid of all the weeds. Because they have a, a very uh, important job I do, and uh, they they are the forefront of uh, rock breaking. And if you think about it, that's uh, you watch, look around, and you get the weeds in your garden. That's the one thing you can pull them out. I like to transplant mine over into the rock bed because I love my weeds so much. But um, anyways, what they do is they break up the rocks. You see, they get in the crack, and they keep a splitting and a splitting and a splitting, and pretty soon uh, the rock gets big enough, split up enough to where a tree seed will fall in there, and then that seed, it'll split it some more and some more and some more, and uh, pretty soon you got uh, a tree or growing up out of a, uh, where the rocks were. You see, and it all started with the weeds. And uh, I know uh, on uh, the, this big Chernobyl thing that happened over in Russia, that's where the nuclear plant, uh, it, uh, it burned up and uh, caused radiation all over the Chernobyl place there in Russia. And uh, all the people had to move on out of the town and stuff. And uh, they've been going back over there and, uh, and uh, finding out that uh, uh, it, it's uh, getting back all right already. And uh, they, and that's because of the weeds. But the weeds come in there, and they started breaking down the buildings, and turn the mold down, and come they tore down, and the more weeds got in there, and the mold, and all of that stuff, and it, and they kept a splitting up the rocks, and and uh, then the deer come back, and uh, the, and then wasn't no deer with no uh, three heads or nothing like that. They're just regular plain old deer and the pigs. And I don't know if anybody said they ain't any of them, I don't know. But anyway, so, so it's getting back to normal real quick. So, see, uh, in the scheme of things, you got your water and your fire and your uh, dirt and your weeds and your trees and your animals. And then come the stupid-ass human uh, messes everything up because he thinks he knows everything and going to use up it all and got to uh, get and use all the resources. You can use the resources, just leave some for somebody else. That's all I got to say. But anyways, I'm getting off the subject about the weeds. Some of them have got some pretty nice flowers on them, and uh, a few of them, if you smoke them, they're pretty nice too. And uh, so, you know, uh, weeds has got a real good purpose in life, and I want to campaign to stop this uh, weed-hating stuff. And uh, it's not right. The weeds ain't done nothing bad to nobody. Uh, let them grow. And uh, if you can smoke them, smoke them. If you don't smoke them, don't smoke them. Uh, and uh, let them uh, bust up the rocks and uh, and get all the trees are growing in there. And then we'll have a beautiful America again. So that's it, America. I'm commentary on the weeds today. And uh, uh, I say love your weeds. Jim Bob is out.